You're watching EAC News. Thank you for joining us. After 38 years of leading Cambodia, Prime Minister Hun Sen announced that he will not continue as the Prime Minister following the formation of a new government mandated by the 7th National Assembly election held on Sunday. In anticipation of a landslide victory for the CPP, he will be transferring power to his son, General Hun Manet, who has been appointed by the CPP as the next Prime Minister. In a special speech this afternoon, the Prime Minister said that he would be relinquishing his position for the long-term stability of the kingdom. ខ្ញុំប្រកាសណាខ្ញុំពិតជាបានប្រកាសខ្លួនថាhe confirmed that many current government officials will also leave their positions, making room for the next generation of leaders in the Cambodian government. He called on ministers to be ready to resign their positions so that the next generation can lead the country successfully. He suggested the ministers may be given seats in the National Assembly instead. <laughs> Once he has handed over his position as Prime Minister sometime in August, he will then be running in February Senate elections to take over as President of the Congressional Body. Senate elections are voted on by fellow government officials rather than the public. 58 of the Senate seats are voted in, while the remaining four seats are appointed by the National Assembly and the King. Currently, the CPP holds all 62 Senate seats. Prime Minister Hun Sen said that even though he will be acting as Senate President, he will not be interfering in future Prime Minister Hun Manet's decisions, which he said he understands must be made independently. Kristen Winters, EAC News.